Hello peeps, welcome back to the best career in my channel here on YouTube. Today back on modded FIFA 23 with Hugo Ortega, the world's largest goalkeeper. Here with Fiorentina, of course, last episode we joined up Fiorentina in Italy in the Serie A on loan. Oh my god, how many goalkeepers does this team have? Jesus Christ. Oh, it's Italy, isn't it? They have a lot of players in Italy. Oh, my God. Look how many strikers we have. Jesus Christ. Oh. We have nine goalkeepers. Oh, my goodness. And before we begin, ladies and gentlemen, be more like Ryan Ambler and subscribe to the Readings Kid YouTube channel. We just hit 25,000. We're trying to hit 50,000, which is our halfway goal to 100,000, which is our main goal. Be like Ryan, ladies and gentlemen, and subscribe. But yes, we are at Fiorentina. And today's episode, we're going to start away from home against Roma. And then we're going to go away from home against Napoli. Then we're going to go to home against Inter Milan. Then we're going to end the episode at home against Juventus. Four matches today. Roma, Napoli, Inter, Juventus. Four massive Massive matches. It's going to be a fun one. Ladies and gentlemen, leave a thumbs up on the video if you are excited. And if you do enjoy, please do subscribe as well. Ladies and gentlemen, let's dive right in. Oh, I do enjoy the Serie A. I really, really do. I love all the overlays and whatnot. Roma, tough team. Roma Fiorentina live on the zone to kick off the episode, ladies and gentlemen. I'm excited. Going from the Premier League to the Serie A, two of my favorite leagues. We scored a lot of goals last episode and we've been looking good. They do have Tammy Abraham up top, big Tam dog. He's a good goal scorer, but hopefully we can get a big three points first chance already. Good save by the goalkeeper. Yeah, nice cross. I like this blue kit that Fiorentina have. I haven't really looked at the kits yet. I know we have a purple one, of course, but I haven't really seen this one before. It's very, very nice color of blue. Abraham pushes up to Pellegrini, who's running against the defense. Back up to Tam Dog. One more to Pellegrini going for goal, forcing Hugo into the first save. Of this match. Pushes wide. He got a little haircut, Hugo Ortega. It says a bit shorter than it usually is. Nice curling finesse shot, Hugo Ortega. Comfy. Hands to the ball. Pellegrini, the skipper, is taking the corner. That one goes in. Oh, Hugo bobbled it. And it goes down, and they've given a penalty. Regardless, they've given a penalty. I'm assuming this kit is so nice. I'm assuming for a handball, Hugo was it. Oh, it. Oh. Outrageous. What's new, eh? Hugo defending a penalty. What's new? Hugo saving a penalty. That's not new because he is a master at saving penalties now. He went from never saving penalties to being one of the best uh, penalty savers we have ever seen in the world of football, ladies and gentlemen. Keeps it at nil-nil. And what a hectic start to this episode. Come back to Hugo if you need. And hoof it out. We don't mess about. All in and around the box. Finesse shot has to be. It has to be from the penalty save. To the other goal, a lovely counter-attack and a lovely, lovely finish. Go over and celebrate in front of the fans, my friend. What a finish from Sotil. Got it, touched it, finessed it, and scored it. It's going to be a fun episode. A lot of challenging matches. It's going to be a fun episode. A oh, nice through ball. Tam Dog. We maybe could have come out there. No, I think it was a bit too far away. We've probably done well staying in our goal. Delefeo. Good deception again. We can't let them get past this defense. Oh, lovely through ball. Soto, the goal scorer, through on goal again. Oh, my God, the counter-attacking football from Fiorentina. Oh, Serie A, this is going to be a fun year in Italy, boys. I know we have no European competitions, but it's going to be a fun year in Italy. Zaluski in some space. Nice through ball. We definitely should have come out there. Oh, almost made a meal out of that. But it goes out for a corner. Oh, goal kick. We take it. Nice one-twos between the attackers. Arthur Cabral in the box. First time shot. Save keeper, another big chance. Keeper's not happy with his defense. I don't blame him. So much space. So much space. Oh, they close the gap. So again. Go for goal, and he does. Oh my god, it's three. Oh my goodness gracious me. It is indeed three. Is that a soul hat trick, lazy? I think it is. I love his haircut as well. I think it's a soul hat trick. Ricardo Soto. Just about got the shot off. Under the defender's legs, and it's 3-0. They're attacking, though, through ball. Oh, he chipped it over us. He chipped it over us. Dele, it would be Dele Feo. I thought we made the right choice running out there. Oh, that's so unfortunate to concede. Lovely through ball. He chipped it over. I mean, nice finish, to be fair. you got to give it to him. 
Little Traveller, we dive down, chipped it up. Fair enough, it's 3-1. Dybala wins it back. Tammy up there as well. Let's not lose control of this match at halftime. We'll take a 3-1 lead. Is your side? Edge of the box. I can't see. Is anyone in there for him? Arthur Cabral. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Come back if you need. Come back. Well done. And just get it out. Not the best at clearances. I'm going to be honest with you, Tammy. Sure, he's blocked back into Tommy Abraham. Good save. You go again. Oh, this match is heating up now, baby. This match is heating up now. There's been chances for both teams. You go. Catches and can hold on to it here. Do you want to play quick? No, just roll it out. Just roll it out. Nice cut inside. Oh, if we get one more goal, I think we wrap it. I mean, I think we're looking pretty good anyway, but one more goal would fully wrap this one up. I'm loving the passing around. I can't even see anymore. Anyone going to go for goal? We're just going to hold on to the ball. Get into the box, maybe. No, we go all the way back. Nice through ball. Arthur Cabral in the box on the volley. No. Cabral. Oh, lucky. I'll call the full-time whistle ref. We'll take conceding one goal here today. It's been a good match. A lot of good saves. A penalty save as well. Three goals for us. And a 3-1 away victory against Roma. We're pushing for the top four this year with Fiorentina. And we have some tough, tough matches today. And that is how we want to start this episode off. Right, Napoli is the team. Back-to-back -back away games. We've lost a few in between the Roma game and this game. But uh, we don't want that to affect our form. We're going to bounce back here against Napoli. Very tough game. Awesome hen running at Hugo Ortega. Now that is a challenging striker to try and keep a clean sheet against. But we've come down this right side early doors. Arthur Cabral, if you can get a pass into the box, which he does touch a shot, could have been a great start. Napoli fourth right now. Milan already on 30 points. Napoli fourth on 19. Oh, Milan are just running away with it. The box. Back to Jovic. We had to zoom in. I was uh, thinking they're in the box then. And we were close. And Luka Jovic gets the... I've always liked you, Lu uh, Luka Jovic. Used to sign him a football manager. Always been a fan of Luka Jovic. Bish, bash, bosh. Lovely passing. Chipped up to him. Lovely touchdown. Pass back into him. First time shot. 1-0 Fiorentina. Oh, baby. Like, what a step up, you know. Not that Forest was fun, but Fiorentina, Serie like, it's, it's such a fun league, Serie It really is. It's competitive as well. I'm liking this team. I'm excited for Hugo Ortega. Can't drink when they're attacking. Oh, my goodness. Almost got caught drinking, ladies and gentlemen. A football manager again. All these different, like, teams and whatnot around the world. <laughs> I'm really excited for FM24. Readings FC making the return to the channel. Unlucky Luka Jovic. Nice passing again. Turn. Oh, shot on target. We're getting a lot of chances today. I think we found a nice blend of gameplay mods. It's been a fun couple of episodes. Maybe it's just a, a Serie A. It's a fun league to play, you know. It really, really is. Nice ball in. Headed out. Edge of the box. They're trying to find their way in. Oh, my God. We were out of a position. Oh, my God. I told you Osman's dangerous. Jesus. The first shot, we were way out of position. Off his knee. Awesome, man. I told you he was dangerous. On the on the volley, actually. From way back there. Put his foot through. Hugo Ortega was beaten. He was beaten. But luckily, hits off the bar. Zielinski. Options in the middle. I thought he was going to shoot then in the middle. He didn't. He goes out to the right-hand side. Shot is blocked. Awesome, man. Oh. Half-time, 1-0. Man City, Napoli next hit. I'm kind of... Uh, oh, that thought. Big chance. I'm kind of sad. Hugo Ortega's without champs or even Europa League this year. I think that's back-to-back -back years now because we definitely didn't have it with Nottingham Forest last, se last season, pardon me. So it's been a couple of years out of the Champions League, Europa League, stuff like that. Has Hugo ever been in the Champions League, actually? He's been on loan to a bunch of smaller teams. I don't think he's ever been in the Champs, actually, yet. We still have a ways to go to a starting four. Barcelona! 1-1. One, one. That should have been a save. We dive left. He went right. Should have been a save. Can we get the goal straight back, maybe? There are players in the box. If we can get a cross in. Oh, no. Should have went deeper. Humble, 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 humble. Who's taken? Gonzalez. He's going left. Nice. Oh, keeper saves. Keeper saves. Oh, a chance to go ahead. I think they... Oh, no. Awesome ends there. I thought they took him off there. See him in the middle now. Inter Milan is the next match for us. Another tough one. Remember, we're ending against Juventus. Four amazing matches for today's episode. We can win this match. will be two for two. Another handball. Oh, my God. Another handball. We can't miss two pens, right?
We got subbed off. Oh, I want to watch the pen first. I want to watch the pen first. We need to watch the pen just to make sure he doesn't miss two. There we go. And now we can jump to result. We got subbed off. They scored 18. Oh, I thought we had three points there. That's a tough one. That's a tough one to take. We're going to try the team highlights at home against Inter Milan. We done it last episode and a few people seem to like it. So maybe we'll do it a little bit more here and then. Not, not every match. Not every match because I like... Um, I like the the freedom. I like the freedom and realism of, of just like playing the normal matches as usual. But every now and then, where we do like this, another penalty save. We'll do team highlights. Maybe shouldn't have been against Inter Milan because this could have been a good game. But we still have Juventus this episode. So it should be fine. Is this against you? See, that's why I don't like it. That's why I don't, like there's no freedom to move. It, it plants you in a position. There's no like I might not we might not position ourselves there normally. That's why I don't like team uh, team highlights or the, the player highlight. I don't like it. I really don't. I thought we tested just because a few of you said you like it. I'm not a fan of it. I don't think we're gonna we're gonna keep doing it. It's just unnatural, you know. I rather see the flow of the game and see the flow of the attack as it comes. Two one to Fiorentina though. We've scored two goals. A crossing opportunity. Which we can't even see. Gets it to the edge of the box. Back to Lazaro. In the box now. Oh my god. Goes wide. 2-1 boys. Hold on please. We should have beat Napoli. We could have won all four of these games. But we'll take two wins and a draw. If we can hold on to this. Going into that Juventus game. DeMarco. Entering the box. Good interception. 3-1. With half an hour left to play. This Fiorentina team. Don't mess about. I'll tell you. They're full of a bunch of dogs. Oh, are we fast enough? No. Why did we come out? He tried to dink it. That's why we came out. Nah. 15 to play. Free kick for Inter. They're deep. They're far back. I see Jekko number nine there. He's the main man to watch out for. Oh, they don't cross in. Interesting. Passing around. Good tackle. Blow the full-time whistle referee. And there it is. A 4-1 win. Sotto with two goals. Sotto is a... Bloody mad, man. Bloody mad, man. We take a 4-1 win. Juventus next. Back at home then. Fiorentina Juventus to end off the episode. Going to be tough. Going to be very tough. We beat Inter Milan, though. We uh, we beat uh, Roma. We drew to Napoli. I mean, so far, it's been a fantastic episode. Oh, you should... If we beat Juventus, it's one of the best episodes we have had Luka Jovic is a absolute genius. Backing down the defense. Turns around and slots it home. I love a bit of Luka Jovic in the morning. 1-0 to the home team. Fiorentina. McKenney. Edge of the box. Goes for goal. Hugo. Oh, my God. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I dived right there. It did it off the post, luckily. I thought it was going to sneak in. McKenney looked up. Goes for goal. Why did he dive so, so late? Maybe he saw it late. Got very lucky not to concede that. Going to be easy. This Juventus team. Never going to be easy. Run into the box. Now edge of the box. Goes for goal again. Across goal. They've hit the post again. They've hit the post again. Oh my goodness. Both times Hugo's been beat. Luckily the post is our saviour. Hashtag thank the post. Chiesa. Up to Vlahovic. They do have Di Maria. Oh my god, the passing back and forth. I can't keep up. Nice through the ball. Space up on the right. Gonzalez. Should have kept going for the shot there. Gonzalez again. Ball into the middle. Oh, why go one more? I thought he made the wrong pass. It was a great pass. But he should have shot. Half time 1 0. We've had chances to be 2 0, 3 0. But we take it. I mean, we've had chances to be 1 1 or 2 1 down, thanks to the post, to be fair. So we take a 1 0 lead. Ball into the box. One more. Square across. There's just so much space there. He chips it up for some reason. Oh, my God. Those are the only ones that annoy me where they just stand there faffing about. Everything else is perfect. Right there. Just pass in and shoot. Jovic. One more. Oh, look. Just keep going there. Why turn around there? I don't understand. Free kick. Chipped in. No way winning that. No way. It does fall to Fiorentina, though. Shezza's good save. Just had a David Goss. Oh, say nice. Said it won't. The best of headers eventually cleared, though. 15 to play. Still 1-0 to the good. 
We've had like double their sh uh, passes. We've actually done very, very well today. Four very tough matches. I'll be honest, I didn't expect to perform how we did today. Hugo has made some great saves. We've scored some great goals and had some amazing results. Don't sub us. Damn, I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. We win 1 0. We win 1 0. We keep the clean sheet. We take it. Ladies and gentlemen, we don't mind. It's annoying when they sub you off as a keeper. But as long as you keep the clean sheet, it is what it is. Ladies and gentlemen, hopefully you have enjoyed. You've left a thumbs up and you subscribe to the Greenskid YouTube channel. Also, check out RPW. Link in the description. We're live here on this channel every Monday, Thursday, and Friday. RK takes over the live stream tab with RPW, the number one wrestling show in sports entertainment. Make sure you check it out and enjoy. Ladies and gentlemen, what is this? Coppa Italia. Freshia Rossa. Oh, TBD. There's no opponent there. I didn't know who that was. Um, When is Venezuela? People have been asking this very quickly before we end. When is Venezuela? Uh, well, Like, when's the World Cup? When's stuff like that we don't get to see? I want to know when... Um, I want to make our Venezuela debut. Well, we're going into 2026. Isn't World Cup next year then? 2026, it is. So maybe we'll have some qualifiers with Venezuela. Who knows? Hopefully one day we can perform with them. Ladies and gentlemen, hopefully you have enjoyed. Uh, much of us always take care. I just hit my glasses. And peace. I never wanna burn down.